I'm Riveru Bay, and welcome to my gun kingdom. At the time this video is being made, uh, since this was manufactured in 1968, it is actually 56 years old. In the 70s, they did some changes to the gun. And if you notice here how this uh, magazine release protrudes out from the lower, the troops were accidentally hitting these to where it would release the magazine by accident. So this is called a no fence lower. And then in the 70s they changed it to where they had actually protection around it so they had a fence lower in the 70s. And also if you notice the bolt has teeth in it and it has no forward assist on it. Well Colt found out that it really didn't matter to have a bolt with teeth. It really didn't hurt in a gun that didn't have a forward assist so they weren't going to change their machinery around to where they would have a smooth bolt and the forward assist of course is not on this gun and this is the way Eugene Stoner the, orig the original designer of the gun that's the way he wanted it without the forward assist now the Air Force put in a big order for these without the forward assist but then the Army decided they wanted the forward assist So today we're going to, I haven't zeroed this rifle in for a while, so we're going to zero it in at 50 yards and we have the conograph and we also have the uh, GoPro sitting down there. I'm going to fire five. So let's go ahead and adjust it to the left. Just above that one. So it still needs to move to the left, I think. Give it another shot. Now this one, we're going to switch to the bottom target now, and what I'm doing is I'm taking that front sight and I'm putting the bullseye right on top of the front sight. Okay, ready to roll here.
that was 2854 15 feet away So those last two kind of high, but they were touching each other, so I'm not sure uh, why I'm shooting high here. Let me. See. That last one I shot was 2830 feet per second. One more here. That last one was 2812 feet per second and it's shooting just a little high. All right, we loaded another five. Let's stay on that lower target. And twenty-eight twelve is what I was reading on that one there. I can see that top target a lot better. Okay, here we go. All right, put it in safe mode. Go over and check. I'm going to try something here. I'm going to hold on to the forearm here and hold it down, see if it makes a difference. 